Hey, this is Juliet Danielle. Um, I just wanted to make a little Christmas video. Um, not because I'm feeling incredibly Christmassy, Christmassy this year, um, but just because um, this is actually a season that's always been really uh, wearing on me as as a young adult, and now as I guess a I guess I'm a middle-aged adult. I don't know. Whatever. Um, it's It's been kind of a hard season, and it's one that I don't really look forward to every year because uh, it stresses me out. Um, all the party invitations and the things that I need to cook and the gifts that I need to buy and the people that I forgot to feel, you know, make them feel special and, and just one thing after the other until all the things I, I normally enjoy, like, like parties and baking and hanging out with my friends and writing letters, all those things that I normally enjoy become a, a thing on my to-do list that I don't really want to do. And all month long, I have just had the most terrible attitude and I feel really badly about it, but it's getting a little better, and um, I just felt really compelled to um, hop on here really quick and say something to the people that um, aren't having a very good time this holiday season. And I know a lot of you um, are sick or know somebody that's sick. Um, I have somebody very close to me that uh, isn't doing very well. Um, there's a couple of my friends right now that um, are battling cancer. Um, and, you know, our families are, are not always um, what we see uh, in the Christmas cards that we send to one another. And sometimes our bright, shiny lives are not exactly matching some of the happy statuses that we put on Facebook. So... I wanted to tell you from my heart something that I know to be true. I know that we're meant to be here. I know that we are all uniquely and wonderfully made. We're special. We're loved. And we have a purpose. And it might not always be clear to us but we're meant to be here. And just knowing that is, it makes me feel good. And wanting to plug into what my purpose is, it's a good goal. And when I'm actually doing the things that I'm meant to be doing and using my gifts the way that I'm, I'm sure that's another thing to put on my to-do list. Um, but that's when I feel good. So I just want to say that if you're having a hard time right now, I want just hold on and things will get better. You have to get up every morning and you have to do the things that are good for you. And sometimes those aren't the things that we want to do. Um, I've got seven months sober now so that's been hard but it's been one of the best things that I've ever done I recommend anybody who's going through um, severe depression and has trouble coping uh, with life like me I would encourage you to try sobriety for a couple months and see how it feels. And I bet you, you'll feel better. So, okay. Um, I don't know if I said all the things I wanted to say, but I'm going to trust that uh, I said all the things I needed to say. So I wish you and your family or you and your cat and your dog or just you, I wish you a very Merry Christmas. And I wish you all the hopes and the dreams for the new year in peace.